Are we live? Are we live? Are we live? Hello, Hello Sippers Kids! Hello, Sippers. Welcome. Welcome. Are we ready for some art? We are going to have a bit of an art show today. It's going to be fun. I'm excited. Are you excited? Yeah, this is our first art Sippers Kids. So first ever art Sippers oh, Kids. Yeah. We're literally buzzing for it. Are you guys buzzing for it? If you are, let us know in the comments. We can't see you. So let us know. Let us know. <laughs> let us know in the comments. So guys, we are Art Sippers. My name's Elliot Naughty. And I am Tracy Pitcher. And together, we are Naughty Pitcher. Naughty Pitcher. Naughty like a naughty person, like naughty. And Pitcher. Naughty boy. Pitcher, a bit like um, a normal picture, but spelled differently. Exactly. So this is our Sippers. We are a creative couple. Yes, we are. We're not, we're not breaking <laughs> we're any not breaking rules. any rules, guys. This is our, our living room. <laughs> so we're going to take you through some art and a cheeky sip. Yeah, cheeky sip. I'll show you what we're painting today. Show them. I think they're excited. Come on. Da, 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 da. Come on, guys. We're going to be painting Grogu, so aka Rogu. Baby Yoda. Baby Yoda. Baby Yoda. So we're going to be painting. It might be a little bit more simplified yes. for some of you. I know some of you um, haven't painted in a long time. Don't worry, we're going to be going step by step and it's a really easy one to do. We're going to teach you step by step, so don't worry guys. Whatever you have, what kind of tools do you have? It could be paint brushes, it could be crayons, yeah, we'll go through the tools it could be minute. pencils, don't worry. We're going to show you step by step how to create that masterpiece. Oh, we can see some people. We've got Stanton in the room. Yes, Hello, Kay Stewart. Hello. Judith McAnally. Bollywood Dreams. Hello, how are you doing? Marie Claire and Joshua, hello. How are you? Where are you watching? Oh, from? like, let us know where you're watching from and who you are in the comments. So, Josie's got a sip. Yes, this is what I'm sipping on today. This so, we're going to be sipping on a Sprala. So, the reason why we say that is because during the show, we press this. Check this happy, oh, happy. happy little bell. Oh, so, when we press it, like so. That means everyone has to have a cheeky, cheeky sip. Yes. This is so you get some perspective and just give you some time to pause oh, away from your work. Yeah, so you can be sipping on juice, a smoothie, yes. um, some tea, some herbal tea. Let us know what you're sipping what on. What are you the sipping on? Too. Do you want to tell them the tools? Yes, I'll go for the tools. All right, let's do the tools. Okay, so some of you may not have paints. So that's totally fine. You can use some pens. I am going to be painting today and I'll be teaching you how to paint it. But if you do have some colored pens, grab your colored pens. You can still do this in pens or pencils. Right, so paint brushes. I'm going to be using three main paint brushes today. We so got the big brush. The big brush. Big brush. <laughs> so this is a big flat brush. It's got a flat edge to it. This is going to be used for the background most of the time. Uh, covering, uh, covering large areas of your canvas or your paper at home. So, big brush. Then we've got a medium brush like this. This has also got a flat edge, a little flat shader. It's okay if you've got a little filbert, you can use a filbert, which is um, the rounded one. But a medium brush, a medium sized brush is good today. And then we've got a small brush. So this brush. is a little round brush. It's got a little tip to the end, and that's going to be used for things like Little baby Yoda hairs, Grogu's eyes, little reflections in the eyes, little details this one. Also got a pencil and a rubber. So grab them, we're going to sketch it out first. Paper towel. This is to wipe your brushes, to clean them, dab off any, um, dab off any excess water. So grab your paper towel. Cheeky dabs. Tap water. This is to wash your brushes. This is to wash your brushes and not to sip from, guys. Don't so sip don't sip. So when we press this, make sure that this is separate from your sipping. Because you don't want to accidentally go, paint water. nobody wants paint. No one wants paint juice. <laughs> you don't want paint juice, do you? No. So make sure they're on two different sides of your tabletop so you don't make any little accidents. And don't dip your brush in your drink either. Don't do it. And then we've got our paints. So these are the paints we're going to be using today. What colours you got, jo I'll Jojo? I'll tell you the colours. Um, so as I said, they're acrylic paints that I'm using. So I'm not using watercolours today. I'm using acrylic paints. They do dry quite quickly. Um, and they're easier to work with sometimes. Definitely for a short amount of time. So I've got some white paint. I've got some dark blues. So this is phthalo blue. So dark blue. Any dark blue, even if you've got a dark blue pen. Cerulean blue. That's the sky colour blue. So that's the lighter blue. See, it's all running everywhere. Got some yellow. 
pink or red, either one. I'm gonna use a bit of pink today, but if you've got some pink, use that. If you've got some red and you don't have any pink, you can use red instead. Black and brown. I've got quite a lot of black because I'm gonna be painting this sky, the background, black. So I've got black and I've got a bit of brown, which we'll use for Grovey's coat. Oh, we got some people. We got Kai we from Jaden from Kerry Savage. Hello hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? We got Shivali is doing this for our hey, brother's Shivali. birthday. Hello, we got Rufus, age five from Congleton. Oh, where hello. are you guys? Give us a shout. Tell Gina us where you Miles. are. Hello, Jaden. Hello. Right, so we've also got an exciting competition today. Ellie, Ooh. do you want to go through the competition? Okay, so this is actually really are exciting. Ready? Boom! We're at the competition wall. So guys, today not only are we going to bring you art with Grogu, aka Baby Yoda, we're going to give you a chance to win a prize. Oh! <laughs> but not just any prize, we're talking about the Art Sippers Experience Box. Yes, this could be yours. There are some goodies inside. What's there are inside? some goodies. Should I open up? Go on, have a look. So why you open up? Look at that. This is the oh, kids box. This is the this kids one. box. This is this could be yours. So the kids box gets a nice little berry. Cheeky little berry. Well, berry. Cool. Okay, we've got some paint brushes. <laughs> we've got some paints. So if you're not using nice. your paints today, 12, you get some. Twelve set acrylic kit. Palette. Nice. Love it. A chocolate. Cheeky bit a of pencil, chocolate. And some canvases. Look at that. It's full of goodies. Full of goodies. So this could be yours. The way to win that is. Because throughout the show, I'm going to be telling you some artifacts. Artifacts. And I'm going to tell you some silly jokes. And I want you guys to answer those in the comments. So if you can answer them in the comments first and first, your name goes up on the competition wall. It's really high tech, I know. So if you answer fast and first be quick. in the comments, your name goes up on the board. And then at the end of the show, I'm going to choose one winner. Yep, so you have to stay to the end to, to the hear end. it. Who is going to be the winner today? So it could be anyone. So you've got to be in it to win it. So make sure that throughout the show, you answer in the comments and you could be a winner today. Do you know what? Everyone's a winner anyway. You're all winners because you're here today with Art Sippers Kids. I'm going to throw you back to Josie. Let's see if technology is going to work. Boom. Right. Some of you may not have painted for a while, but seeing as you've all been probably doing a bit of art at school with some creative stuff, I'm sure you're quite good at art. I'm looking forward to seeing your pieces today. So what we like to do just before we start, we like to have a little mindful moment. Um, oh, what's that? Before that, let's tell them about our one rule. Oh, we do we have, have one, one rule. rule at Arts. That's really interesting. What's our rule? Our one rule is be kind. No judgment. That's the only rule. So no judgment <laughs> means um, when you're getting frustrated with your work, mm -hmm. you're, you're not allowed to. You're not allowed to get angry. Don't try. Try not get angry at your work. Just take a breath and uh, breathe in. And keep calm. It's supposed to be fun. We're supposed to be, be having fun. a good time today. We're going to have great. a lot of fun. So, there are no wrong or right yeah. answers here. We just want you to have fun and let's have a good time. And don't get angry um, and try not and laugh at other people's work as well. So if, we you're, if you're painting with any siblings, any brothers or sisters, no laughing at each other's work. That's, no what, no just That's the only rule we have. So I'm going to take you now through a mindful moment. Is yeah. everyone ready? Okay, so during our classes, usually we do this in bars and pubs around London, but we're now doing it with you. Now everyone feels good. To create art, what you need to do is feel calm and present. And to do that, we want you to get into the zone. And how do you get into the zone? I'm going to show you. So is everyone with me? Is everyone with me? So what I want you to do, I want you to stand up. Yes, I've said it. Stand up, guys. Stand up. And now you're on your feet. Hopefully you're on your feet. I want you to do this. At the end of a race, you usually win the race. Of course you win. And what do you do? You raise your hands in the air. So what I want you to do is raise your hands in the air and take a really deep breath. One, two, three. And I want you to breathe out on the exhale and put them down. And we'll do that two more times. Hands in the air. And breathe out. And then one more time. Hands in the air. Reach to the skies. Wow. And, and then let's shake it out. Come on, guys. Shake it out. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it like a Polaroid picture. Let's get out all those negative vibes. And Art Sippers Kids, let's go! Are you ready? So we've got quite a few people here. I'm just going to have a look at the comments quickly. It's got Emmy and Lisa from Germany. Hello from Germany. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, your auntie's friend Amy. So is that Bob's there? Hello, Bob's. Dexter and Harley, hello. Oh, we've got loads of people from all over the place. Olivia all over and Lauren, UK. nice to see you. So, guys, grab your 
piece of paper or your canvas and turn it on its side, so landscape wise. And grab your pencil, we're gonna start sketching. Before we start sketching, oh, let's go in with an artifact, aka a silly joke. Silly you ready? Man, try and guess the answer to this. What is a Star Wars fan favorite day of the year? Favorite day of the year. What's a Star Wars fan favorite day of the year? If you know it, answer the questions. Let's go. Quick. Right. So what I need you to do is split your piece of paper or your canvas in half. So I'm using a stretch canvas today, so it's quite thick. Uh, but you could be using paper, uh, you could be using some card, or you could even be using a bit of cardboard, from a, like a cardboard box. And what I'm going to do is get you to put a line right through the middle down here with your pencil. This one's going to be really faint, okay, so don't do this too hard. Really lightly, because you're going to be rubbing this line out. I'm going to do mine a little bit harder so you guys can see at home, but you don't want to do this hard. I'm going to do it very light. Try and do it as straight as you can. Hello from Emmy and Noah Webster. <laughs> oh, we've got some people answering that. Wow, quick fingers, guys. They're not playing about, love it's it. Quick today. Okay, so once we've done that line down the middle, the reason we've done that is to separate where the head's gonna be and kind of where the body's gonna be. So Gregory's head's gonna be at the top up here and it's gonna be in the middle and it's gonna be it's kind of like an egg shape an oval shape, we're going to do this kind of circle here. Now it's not a, a proper circle, it's a bit of a flattened one, so we're going to do a squash circle, an oval shape. I'm going to do that right in the middle, and it's going to be around about here, so let's start. So, squash circle, kind of like an egg shape, but oval shape. You can do this in pencil a little bit harder now, because you're not going to be rubbing this line out. This one you can do quite hard. Oh, we got people overseas, Jojo. We got people overseas. Someone said that they're in NYC. Wow! Kelly and Amelie. Is it Amelie? It's Amelie. Amelie in NYC. Hello. Hello, guys. Thank you for joining us today for our first Arts for Kids. That's amazing. So we usually do this for adults um, on Friday evenings, <laughs> but we're doing it for kids now. So we have a lot of a lot of kids joining us. And it was just a bit too late, wasn't it? Sometimes it was running a bit too late in the evening, so we thought, let's do something for lockdown. Yeah, well, let's do something for the kids that are stuck inside. I know it's really annoying being stuck inside at the moment, but we're going to have some fun today. So really lightly again, do a cross like this down the middle of your circle, your egg shape. You want it down the middle. Didn't really do that down the middle. <laughs> that there. Do them really lightly that cross there. And we're going to start by doing Grogu's face. We're going to make two little markers for the eyes, and it's going to be the corner of the eyes here. So we're going to go sideways a little bit from this middle line, go out a little bit, and do a marker. So many people are getting it right, Joe. So many people are right. But who's going to get it first? Who's going to get it first? Close one. Kelly's got it right. It was May the 4th. Yay! <laughs> so one May is a Star fourth. Wars fan. Be Favourite day of yours. It's 4th of May. So many people got it right. Look at this. Whoa. So many people. But Hi, somebody got it right Hi, first. Nelson. It was Kay Stewart. Kay Stewart, you got it right first. Your name is on the board. Well done. Hi, Joe. Right, so then we've got, our, we've got our first marker. Let's do the marker again, starting from that middle of the cross, go sideways to the left. We're we'll do another marker, and that's the other corner. So we've got one corner there, one corner there. That's gonna be the eyes. So that's the middle of the cross. We're going sideways on that line and sideways on that other line the other way. We're going to do the same over here. So a little marker. Go to the edge of the circle, bring it in a little bit, and then do a marker. And that's going to be how wide the eye is. So come to this side, go in a little bit, and that's going to be your other marker. So we've got four markers. 
So you're going in, that side, in that side. Come from the edge, go in a little bit. Come from the edge, go in a little bit. And then we're going to do a hill shape. So from this marker to this marker, we're going to go up the hill and around. This is going to be the eye. It's a big hill. And we're going to do that the other side as well. Another big hill from one marker to the other. Liking those hills. Nice hills. Because Grogu's eyes aren't just round, they're oval shaped like ours. But they're very big. He's not bigger. They're like me when I was a kid. I used to have really big eyes. You still do have very I big eyes. I still have humongous <laughs> eyes. Look at that. Check those <laughs> eyes out. I'm basically Grogu. <laughs> <laughs> And then we're going to go down and under. So we're going to go from this marker to this marker and we're going to go in a big U shape. Oh, like that. Down and under, big U shape. Pretty much done the eyes nearly. Well done, guys. Let us know if we're going too fast, too slow. We'll see what we can do and see if we can manage it to make sure that everyone keeps up to pace with us. These are the eyes. I'm going to put the actual eye inside, so like this. We're gonna do a big circle inside. So keep them within your eye. Just turn it into a bit of a circle. So you can do this little shape that side and a little shape that side, a little curve. Hi from Luke and Zoe in Hertfordshire and shout out to Jay who is loving the class. Saying that, is anyone celebrating a birthday? Who's celebrating a birthday Hello, in lockdown? Hello mini bandits. Hello mini bandits. If you're celebrating a birthday, let us know. We'll give you a cheeky little shout out. Yeah, let us know. Make sure you have a sip guys. We've got a birthday next week. Right, so we've got our big eyes. Let's do the little cute nose. So from that cross, go down a little bit. And we're gonna do two circles, like bean shapes, either side of that line. So two little dots for the nostrils. Do you know that Baby Yoda looks really cute and young? Uh -huh. But do you know he's actually not that young? Do you know how old he is? He's not a baby baby. He's not a baby baby. He's not a baby baby. If anyone can tell me how old Baby Yoda is, aka Grogu, your name goes on the board. <laughs> it's not actually Baby Yoda, is it? It's Grogu. It's Grogu. So tell me how but old we baby Grogu Yoda. is and I'll pop you on the board. Make it happen. Let's go. <laughs> okay, so we've got our nose. Let's do a little um, C shape over this side, around it. So that's going to give you the nose. You see, you got a little, did a little C. It's a little curvy line, and another curvy line this side too. Now you've got your, you've got your nose. Beautiful. Let's give Yoda a big mouth. So we're going to do a line underneath here. It's just a big flat line. He hasn't really got a lip. He hasn't got much of a mouth, does he? No, he's got one of those. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Apart from it goes down. Mm. Can anyone do that? Can anyone do that? Who can do that? You can even make it go down if you wanted to. His mouth does kind of go down a bit. Ellie and F, she said it's her brother's birthday and he's so excited. Yay! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! You can do a little chin, a little curvy line. Chin. Whoop. And don't forget. All these like little wrinkles that he has in his head. He's got muscles there. He's got like two little muscles on, his, on the top of his head there. Let's do a couple of them lines, shall we? So we'll do this little, is it muscles on the forehead? Three wrinkles muscles. as well? Yeah, let's do them lines. So many people are getting it right. Everyone knows his age. They know his age. Well done, we got some clever. super fans in today. So super clever. fans. So we'll do that line down the middle first, like that. So that's kind of where we've already done the line. And then we'll do a W. W shape. A W. Yeah, it's like a big W. That's a really big W. I like that. Hi, Ava in London. Ava. Izzy from Harlow. We got people. Hello, Kerry Savage. We've got 300, was her guess? That wasn't right. We've got Natalie Simpson said it was 150. The Cat Clan said 120 years old, she thinks he is. Who else? Who else? Who's guessing? We got 50 years. Could that be right? Mm. Maybe. We got, how many years is that? <laughs> how many years is that? <laughs> if you can tell me how many years is that, you can go on the board. Go on, love. Tell me how many years. Okay, so I'm going to join these together with a big M shape. So we did the W, now we're going to do the M shape at the top. So that's the 
few muscle bits. And let's do some lines. Let's do a line around the eye, both sides. So it just follows that curve, and we'll do a couple of lines. Do you know who's got it, Jojo? Who? The Milson family. Boys. Well done. You actually said that we should paint this today. Yeah, so, so this is. Them, we're painting this. Because of you guys, we're doing Grogu. So 50 years old, that's how old Mr. Baby Yoda, a.k.a. Grogu, is. <laughs> okay, let's do some more wrinkles. So these wrinkles are going just wavy, like boink, 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 boink. So it's like jumping. It's like little hurdles. Yeah. Little bumps. bumps. Little bumps. Let's do some bumps. Four bumps. Let's do some big ones over this head here. So one, two, three, four. Bump, 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 bump. I love that. Everyone's trying to guess that number <laughs> <laughs> that love Ava answered. The gym bandit said that's Elon Musk's salary. <laughs> love that. And we're doing another bump. Bump, 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 bump. Oh. Can... oh. She's trying to guess it. Do you think that's right? Billion, maybe? <laughs> that was a billion. Should we give it to her? <laughs> right, let's do some wrinkles under the eyes. So let's do a little line there. Maybe a little line there. A couple of little lines. Okay. Let's do the ears. Let's do it. Them eyes are going to look a little bit freaky until you paint them in. So it's not going to look cute until you painted them. So sorry, Grogu. Not sorry, cute Grogu. right now. It's okay. Let's do these um, ears. So you see this circle here? Come down where it's just about to turn around. So it's just going around the corner. And we're going to do a big line out like that. Just straight all the way to the... All the way to the edge? Edge, nearly to the edge. Not all the way. Almost, almost. So you're going towards the side of the paper. And you're going straight. And the same over this side. So find it when, you can even find it across here. So you can go all the way across and find the equal. Or you can just see where it's about to go flat and around. And you're going to go straight out. You're going to do a straight line. Nice. He's got really long ears, isn't he? Yeah. Stretch out. I actually did, decided to draw him this way to start with. And then I couldn't fit his ears in. So <laughs> it was, he was getting smaller and smaller. And I was like, do you know what? We'll just do it this way instead. Okay. So do you remember when we did that cross? In the middle of the circle there find where that line hits the corner and we're gonna go we're gonna turn this into a really big triangle really we're gonna meet from this side to this side going kind of up go up 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 and then you've got the top of the ear that's just the top of the ear so that's this bit here i'll show you again can you see this is the top of the ear so it's not the biggest part of the ear it's the top bit this bit here it's a big long triangle thank you so you find that little line where we cross the middle of the circle go from there and go all the way to the edge same this side find that line where we crossed here and then we're going to go up 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 all the way to there he's got very small ears right now let's he make does. them bigger so they come all the way down to nearly the bottom of his chin there. Not all the way though. So let's go up to this bit here, round about here. And we're going to join here all the way down. Go down to there. It's almost like a big triangle, isn't it? Yeah, now it's a big triangle. Big triangle. Same. We're going to get this one here and we're going to join it to his face. So come from the point of the ear, come all the way down to the bottom of his face. Oh, well, we got a debate. Gina Brown says that she guessed it first. Gina, I'm going to... Check the system, and if the system says it, you're going on the board too. But you know what? We're feeling generous. So we're going to bang you up on the board. Gina, you're on the board. Look at that. So our system puts it in um, how whoever puts it first goes first on our system. But you might see it slightly different at home. because just depends on the timing. Yeah, it depends on how fast your internet is. <clears throat> okay, we're going to do the coat now, just the collar of the coat. We're going to do these kind of wonky rectangles so you can see it's kind of like a rectangle but it's a wonky wavy one we'll do two of them two wonky rectangles coming from the ear just where the ear is wonky wavy wavy wonky wonky up to the chin so starting from the ear go down go across you can do a wave it doesn't matter how wavy you do it and then you wave back up to the chin 
people are still trying to guess that number. Do you think that's what it is? Is it a trillion? Marie Claire has gone for 10 quadrillion. <laughs> Could be. I need to check to my friend, Mr. Google, and see if that's right. Okay, so we're going from this here. We're doing another wonky rectangle. We're going down, and then you're meeting all the way to here. So it's almost like a backwards L shape, actually, a wavy L. So I'm gonna give you a nice quick one because I want you guys to get on the board. Can you name me what is the TV channel that The Mandalorian is on? What TV channel? Nice and easy. Pop it in the comments, guys. Oh, one disclaimer. If you're already on the board, you can't get on the board again. So try and give someone else another try. And UK residents as well. Only UK yes, residents. You can only send it to UK. Can uh, win we, this prize. We, we can give another prize if you were, uh, were to win, but we can't send out the box. Okay, so we're going to do this bit here, which is the where the coat closes and it's just two lines going straight so these lines are going straight down and then we're going to do this line going straight down we're going to do this line going straight down so four straight lines going down nearly down so four straight lines one going down here so this is in the middle of the coat and then another one going down here so they're quite close together well people are getting this one everyone seems to know what channel it's on I guess because everyone's a super fan Super Makes sense. Well, who got it right first? Who had the fastest finger? Another line going straight down, straight down. That's the main part of the coat. So, okay, if adults are joining in at home today. Yeah, who's who's a big sipper? Who's are you joining us too? If you're a big sipper, give us a wave. Give us a wave. Write in the comments, let us know. So we, yeah, we usually have some small sippers, some little sippers come in to our classes. So some of them are here today as well. So tell us if you are a newbie. If you're a newbie, say newbie in the comments so we can see if it's your first time ever coming to art sippers. I think most of them are because they're all art sippers kids. Yeah. So we're going to do another line and it's going to go direct um, in a diagonal down to the corner, this corner of your piece of paper or canvas. So starting from the collar, we're going to point down here and we're going to go, go like this and, and we're going to stop up there. Same over this side, a big wavy line all the way down to the corner. Don't go all the way down, Just stop halfway. And then we're going to join that to the body. Body, body, easy peasy. Easy peasy. And then one more line, not two more lines for the coat. This one here, that is just for the sleeve. Looks like he rolls up his sleeves. He rolls big, them up. Big little coat on it. He's a only a little fella. He's only a little fella. Of course he has to roll them up. He probably has to get custom made outfits. And we're going to give him, he's got three like claw like fingers. I'm gonna give him three. So one, two, and then one coming this way. Three. We got a bunch of oldies and newbies today. We got big sippers in, we got big sippers, and we got little sippers. I love it. We got Hannah Morrison said that my boyfriend loves Star Wars, so I had to paint this one. We've got big sippers in the room. We got the Rapsums in the room, says Rapsums here. Hello, Rapsum. Hey, DC. We hey, got the Macanallys in the room. She's an oldie, but a goodie. Two little sippers, all newbies. Hello, Jody kid. We see you. Do three fingers this side as well. So I like to do one kind of curving round like that. That's two fingers. So it's like a, a bubble N. No. Nah. And then another one. Another finger like that. It's got three fingers over there too. So both got three fingers? Yeah, you give them um, him nails as well. He's got like little yellow nails. They look quite sharp. So they're like little triangles. U-shapes, V-shapes, do V-shapes. There you go, V-shapes. Small little Vs. V Small for victory. Vs. On the end of the fingers, do a little V. V, 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 V. You've even got this Stanton in the room. Yay. Hello Stanton. Right, so there'd be a couple of things to rub out, and that's that line going down the middle. You don't want that. And that little cross that goes through. My rubber's gone on this. <laughs> but you, you don't really want that line going through. So rub around your lines and rub that line out. Now, that if you're doing it, what's that? The Stanton, he's the 
he's the head of our community. He is. If you ever have any um, questions, if you go to the Zip Society, well, we've got a new one now. We've got a new one. Do we do bang up? Yeah. Boom. So Art Sippers Kids Club is now open. So if you guys check Facebook and go to the Art Sippers Kids Club, we will be in there. And the Stanton, he is our community lead. So we're going to get you guys at the end of the show to post all of your artwork into the Sippers I was going to say Sibber Society, yep. the Art Sibber's Kids Club. That's a, it's a, a Facebook group. So yeah, you can post all your pictures. We love to see them. We love. Obviously, we can't see everybody's today. We might get a couple of you live. But we, as we can't see your paintings right now, we'd love for you to send them to us. So either put them in that Facebook group, Art Sibber's Kids Club, or you can send them to our Instagram. We've got Art Sibber's Kids on Instagram. So please, please, please send them through. We'd yeah. love to see them. Keep your artwork, take a picture and then pop over to us. That's a good point, actually. Yeah. If you haven't taken a picture of your artwork right now, take a picture where you are. It's good to see your progress. It's always good to see how far along you come, because it really does. It does. It's really good to see your progress. And if you take a picture, see it before and before after. And after. I'm sure you'll be surprised. Yeah, be good to see. Right, we're gonna go in and start painting now. If you've got your pens at home, you're gonna to wanna to grab a dark green color, and you can go around your outline in dark green. So all the pencil that you just did, go around it in dark green. So if you're not, and you're painting with me, um, we're gonna make a nice kind of dark green color. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix some yellow and blue together, and a little bit of white. So take a bit of white to the side, using your medium brush. So this is your medium brush, guys. I'm using the medium brush, because if we mix with the small brush, it won't mix a lot of paint, it's very small. So we're gonna take a bit of white to the side. I'm painting on a bigger canvas, so, um, bear, like I'm taking a little bit more paint than you guys, probably. So then put a bit of yellow in there. So you've got a, a light yellow color. So some people might not have paints. Yep, so they can use the pencils. And then put a bit of blue in there. So I'm using the sky. Pencils or pens is fine. Pencil and pens are fine. If you ever want to get any pens or paint, can not say the word? Mm -hmm. Paint or any kind of things or art kits, you can head over to Art Sippers and I'll pop it in there so you guys can see. So can you see I'm mixing a bit of yellow and blue together to get green? So yellow, blue and a little bit of white. We're getting a green colour. Like this. Put some dark blue if you wanted it to go a little bit darker. Oh, we got old wee sippers. We got Leo in the building. Yay! Hello, Leo. He's a great painter. There we go. That's our dark green. You can even put a little bit of black if you wanted it to go a little bit more dull. But we're going to go with this colour, right? So, we're going to go down to our small brush. And what you need to do is outline your rogu. So, using your small brush, get your dark green. And you want to do an outline, so you just do it where the wrinkles are. So what brush is that, Joe? This is the small brush now. So go down to your small brush, you'll be able to get a better line. And just go around your outline. Oh, Hannah said, how did you do the hands, picture? Ah, so we just did, can you see? So um, one finger, two finger, and then the third finger. The third. The third finger, the thumb, kind of curved round this way. The other fingers curved round that way. Same with these ones. We did the thumb curving around that way, and then the fingers. And little V's as well. Little V's for the nails. Little V's for the nails. So I'm just putting my. Just go over your lines with a small brush. All your wrinkles. All the outlines. Some people have been here for ages. Some people have been here since we did Hope the Whale. Wow. So just outline the green with the face. Don't do don't do this outline just yet. Just the green with the face. We'll, we'll go to brown for the for the coat. I didn't mention that. Sorry. So round the wrinkles and round the ears. So don't do the coat with the green. Just do the face because the coat's not green. The coat's brown. So that's true, guys. In last lockdown, we actually had hoped the blue well for the Natural History Museum. So if you like painting and you like being creative. 
Just type into YouTube, Art Sippers Natural History Museum, and you'll see we actually did four events for them last year. Mm -hmm. We did Hope the Blue Well, Beautiful Bee, we did Giraffe, Giraffe, General Giraffe, and we did Rawsome Rex. So if you want to paint along with us, guys, we've actually got four other shows that we did with the Natural History Museum. So just give us a look and you'll see. If you're, if you're enjoying this, we don't know. We hope you're enjoying this. Let us know. If you're not, please don't let us know. <laughs> we did say this is going to be an hour. And we, we, we hope some of it. We, we might go over a little bit. Hopefully not too much. I think we got someone from the furthest away. We got someone from Peru. Hello, culture. Hello. Wow, Peru. Where are you guys watching from? Go around the head. Okay. Do you want me to tell them the last answer, Jojo? Yeah, do it. Okay, so the last question was, what TV channel is The Mandalorian on? And of course, it's Disney Plus. Yay. Who got it right? Kelly Robbins. Well done, Kelly. You're on the board. Just doing the last little bits of the face. We got Big Sippers, Michael from the Gin Bandits in. We got Mummy Helen's in. Hello, Mummy Helen. We see you. Zuzanna is in. Izzy's mum. Hello, hello. We got Sorry. Birmingham in the room, Jojo. We got Sally Hull. Yay. That's where the stance is from. So I nearly finished my outlines of the face. And the eyes. LJ Pena said, you're going too fast, picture. You're going too fast. I think you guys can also pause and you can actually rewind if you like. Yeah, you can always pause it. So if you want, you can always pause where you are, pause the little button, and then you can actually come back and follow. So this is, we're gonna try our best to keep this over an hour. Um, if you want, I think it's you can always pause like it, and, and then you can catch up when you get to where we are. Because this is the first kids one we're doing, we did think to try and keep it quite short. Sure. We're giving it a try, we're giving yeah. it a try. Let us know Bear how you find it. with us if it goes over a little bit. Hopefully you haven't got too much to be doing today. We're all stuck inside anyway. So I just went over the outlines. Those at home that are doing um, it with pens, you can start colouring in the greens. You can see from the picture, it's kind of a light green. So you would use a light green for these areas here and maybe a bit of pink underneath the ear. So all I've done is done the outline of the face using a small brush. And then when you've done that, you can do the outline of the coat in brown. So using that small brush, once you've done the outline of the face in green, you can use your burnt umber, so some brown, and do the coat in that colour. What brush size are you using, John? Small brush. It'll give you a nice line. If you feel comfortable using a medium brush, you can use the medium brush. Medium brush on its side, and you can go around like this. That. And those that um, have been quite a few times or paint quite a lot, you can of course um, do the advanced version and put more shading, shadows and highlights. We're trying to cater to um, quite a large audience today, so we have people as young as maybe four, five? We did yeah, say we five said plus. five and up, but there Is might there be some younger? who's, who's yeah. younger than five. If you're younger than five, get mummy or daddy to press the number into the comments. Let us know who's our younger sipper and who's our older sipper. You never know. You actually never know. We can't see you guys. We're doing this in our living room. I w did think about doing this even more basic, but I, I actually believe that everybody can do this. Like that's true. That's our belief. We believe really, that everyone really young kids can do this. is creative, and it just takes a little bit of patience, a little bit of time. But we believe that even little sippers can do extraordinary things. Yeah, and this is something that I would have taught to the adults, to be honest. <laughs> and. Uh, and I thought, well, I could simplify it even more, but I want you guys to create something really nice that you can give to your mum, your dad, the guardian, anyone who's looking after you, your nan, someone in your family, or even your friend, or you can put it up on your wall. Yeah, who are you going to give this to? Seriously, this is such a great little gift as well to give to someone. Forget a custom card, 
Give them a custom art piece. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Handmade gifts are the best. Oh, I've got something for them, Joe. Go for it. Are you ready, little sippers? Are you ready, little sippers? Let's go. So what is Jabba the Hutt's middle name? What is Jabba the Hutt's middle name? Nice and easy. Pop it in the comments. Don't overthink about it. Just, just say what you see in the comments. Let's do it. I forgot to say, we do these hands in green as well. So that green that you just used, we're going to do that in green. So give your brush a wash. When you're washing your brush, be really careful with your brushes. Show them how to do it, Joe. So, imagine you're painting the bottom of the cup. So rather than go press really hard and make all the bristles stab the bottom, you want to paint the bottom of the cup back and forth, back and forth. Tap off some excess water. And then you can paint your paper towel to get any excess paint off. And you're good to go. Oh, we've got sippers all over the place, Joe. We've got sippers all over the place. And we've got some oldie sippers and nudie sippers. So we've got Body With Dreams. She's saying that we've got eight and 11 with us. Yay. Chloe, she thinks she's probably the oldest sipper in the room. We got Jody Varney says we got a six year old, a nine year old, and a 48 year old. Come on. We've got Cat Clan. Who's who she got? She got a six year old, and Lauren is 11. How sweet. Hi, guys. And Stephanie Richter, she's got she's got two. She's got two little ones. We've got five, seven, and I'm guessing you're 37. So good to have you guys join us today. Like I said, this is our first ever Art Sippers Kids. We've been asked a few times if we'll ever do one, and we said we might in the future. We didn't know if we'll ever do one, but we thought we might. We've been doing this for a year and a half. I say yeah. almost almost two years. But our last year, obviously, like everyone else, got shut down. So we thought, what can we do to spread some positivity and creativity around yeah. the world? And we thought, let's get in front of the camera. We've never done it before. And I hope you guys, <laughs> hope we're doing all right. <laughs> and since then, we've been doing lockdown lives. And we've just been trying to build our little community of sippers. And this was just another opportunity we thought, Kids also need some entertainment, and adults yeah. also need some time to relax. So we thought, let's try our as kids, and if it goes well, we might even do some more. But we're definitely going to do four, and we'll yeah. see how it goes. Every Sunday every, every from Sunday. this week. From this week, so we've got three more. Three more. Two till three. And let us know. If this isn't a good time, let us know. If you want a different time. Feedback as well. Feedback is necessary. And you guys next week actually choose what we're painting. So we're going to pop that into our Instagram um, and let us know what you want to paint this week. So yeah. it's all about the Milsoms. You gave us the idea for Grogu. And next week, you guys have your input. So if you join the Sippers, I keep saying the Sippers Society, our Sippers Kids Club, we're going to give you the opportunity to actually decide what we're painting next week. Let's do it. So you can, pop, you can even pop in the comments now if you wanted to, but we will give you the opportunity on our Sippers Kids Instagram. So we're going to make a light green now. So take some white to the side. If you do have a light green, you could just use your light green. You don't have to mix it. I'm just teaching you how to mix a light green. Um, green is always made with the primary colors, yellow and blue. Um, and we're gonna put some white just to lighten it up. But if you do have, let's see, if you have a green already. Oh yeah, something already have a green. If you've already got like a sap green, you can add some white to that. You don't have to make your own green. We could add some yellow to it to make it brighter. We're gonna take some white to the side. We're gonna make a baby blue. Always start with white first. If you're making a light colour, it's always good to start with white. That's a really good tip. So tell them that, Joe. So always light to dark. Yeah. So if you're mixing any light colour, um, rather than add white to the pink, if you wanted the light pink, or add white to the blue, um, do it the other way around. So always take white to the side first and then add your colours because white is the lightest colour. So you want to make sure you start with that one so you don't waste all your paint. So I've made a baby blue and then I'm adding some yellow in there. Love Ava has asked us, where will this be saved? So for now, we're going to keep them all up on YouTube for totally free. Yep. Anyone can watch at any time. So we're going to do all of our four free events, and you guys can watch them online. So if you're there, just join our YouTube channel, and you'll see that all of these events will be in there. You can watch them anytime. Make sure you hit subscribe and the like button, yeah, and share with as many people as you can. Let's spread some positivity so during these times. We're That's still a very, needed. very small business, and we could... Uh, yeah, we could do with as much sharing as possible just to get the word out there and let as many kids know as possible. Do you know what our motto is? Go on. 
made this up guys i think this is quite good creativity is contagious pass <laughs> like art it. on like smashed it <laughs> so pass it on guys we want you to pass it on share it with your friends share it with your families if you're enjoying yourself so that's that's the main thing yeah if you don't like it then you don't, <laughs> don't, don't tell anyone don't tell anyone <laughs> right, so as I said, I made a really, can you see this is like a Yoda colour now? So I took some white to the side, I put a tiny bit of yellow and a tiny bit of blue, and it made a really light green colour, and there's the Yoda colour. Hey, so well not done. too much of it, white, um, not, too many, not too much yellow or blue, just a little dab of each. So you take a bit of white, tiny, tiny dab of yellow, and then a tiny dab of blue, and you'll get Yoda colour. Yoda colour, nice and green. And when you've done that, paint Yoda. Now, if you go over them, them dark lines a little bit, that's okay. You can always go over them again. But you've got that stencil there now. So I paint the top of the ears in this light green. Oh, I'm trying to do a straight line, but it's very hard when I'm standing up. <laughs> I also did a little line down here, so you can't see it, but I did. Is that a medium brush, John? Yes, sorry, medium brush. Medium Thank brush for this one, guys. If your medium brush is too big, it depends on your, the size of your. It does depend on the size of your paper. Just use whichever brush you feel comfortable with. And then you can paint inside here, too. So the last question, guys, was. I'm going to do a little split screen. Is that right, Jojo? Yeah. Oh, screen's gone. I've lost the screen. There he is. It's back again. Yes, there he is. So the question was, what is Jabba the Hutt's middle name? What is Jabba the Hutt's middle name? And a few of you got it right. A lot of you, actually, because it's not hard. The answer was the. <laughs> Jabba the Hutt. That's his middle name. So who got it right first? It was Bollywood Dreams Dance. Congratulations, Bollywood Dreams Dance. You're on the board. Well done. Congratulations. Well done. If your paintbrush gets too clogged up, like my one here, I can't get any nice lines with that. So I'm going to keep giving it a wash. Paint them on the cup. Give it clean. Dip the tip. Dip the tip. I like that. Mm -hmm. And then. And why do that? Have a sip. There we go. So yeah, today we're actually sipping on Esprala. So Esprala actually comes in the box, the kids experience box. Oh yeah. So what it is, it's a lightly fizzy apple and it's got red plum and it's a lovely, lovely natural tea string. It's actually really nice. Delicious. What are you sipping on? Today? What are you sipping guys? I saw some people were sipping on some tea earlier. Are you sipping on some juice? What juice is it? So you've got your stencil there and you can paint kind of around it now that you did your your first sketch. I just start sipping your drink, Jojo. <laughs> <It's my room. laughs> so carry on painting all around, all around. Not looking too cute yet, we'll do his eyes soon. Now, with the background, I did like a galaxy, but you guys can get really creative and paint whatever you want in the background. We'll go through that in a minute. Some of your lines might be a bit wet, so you'll see it smudging just a tiny bit. It's okay. Oh, well, we got LMG. She's saying that Eva is eight. Hello. Hello, Kelly Eva. Kelly Owen, eight and 38. We got some oldie sippers and granddad cocks. Hi, Thomas and Lucy, granddad 61. He is the oldest, is he? Granddad, are you the oldest in the room? Hello, granddad. Hello, granddad. Chloe DMG says, I used to come to the other one, but I've not been in a while. Welcome back, Chloe. Welcome back. Welcome back. And we've got Kelly Robbins says, we're five and a half and 39 years old. Hello, guys. So, so glad that you're joining us today. It's actually amazing. We didn't think anyone would turn up. <laughs> yeah, we didn't know. We just thought, let's give it a try. And it seems like we've got a few people in the room. So hello, everyone, and thanks for coming and joining us on this Sunday afternoon. There we go. Got the green. Yoda. I'm going to go on with another one. You ready? What is a Jedi's favourite toy? What is a Jedi's favourite toy? If you know the answer, 
Pop it in the comments, it's over there. It's that side. Pop it in the comments over there. Sip, sip, have a little break, have a little look at it. There we go. I'm painting the hands, green. Go Same colour, that light like green. Paint them fingers. Use your small brush if you can. At least you know someone's enjoying it. LMG says she's enjoying it. We enjoy it. We appreciate that. Thank you. Gina Brown said that she's sipping on some orange juice. Yum. Olivia and Lauren are drinking orange squash. Yay. Yes, love it. I haven't had some good squash in ages. I haven't yeah. had. I used to have that all the time when I used to play football. We've got orange juice, but orange squash. Not orange squash. Mmm, making me salivate. There we go. Now, as I said, if you're an advanced sipper, you can, of course, add a bit more shadows and highlights. So you can add a bit more of a, a darker shadow, maybe around the ears here. You might want to add a bit more shadow around here, like the little bum chin that he's got. Kind of cute. It's not bum chin, is it? It's a little cute chin. It's cutie. Little cutie. You might want to add some shadows there. Eddie, if you want to show them the the main painting. Oh, look at his big eyes. It's the cutest. You can do some shadows. You can do a little bit more of a highlights in certain areas, but we're keeping this one short today. Maybe we'll teach it in the adult one one time. But you can add, can you see? I've just done that little U shape there for the chin and I've just done that in the dark green. But you can add a few more dark colors if you need to. And if you painted any, any over any then wrinkles, you can go over them again with that dark color. It's just so that you had that template to work with. But I can't wait, we can't wait to see what, oh, how you do at home. Yeah, we want to see your artworks, guys, so make sure you send them in to us. And, oh, we didn't say, if you're, if you're on Instagram, take a little story. Do a story and then tag Art Sippers. We love to see your stories and we will repost them in our story. So tag Art Sippers Kids in your story and we will then add them to us. We want to see what you guys are doing. We want to see your creations. That's the part, point of art, passing it on. Hopefully we can spread creativity through, or positivity through creativity. Did I say that right? I think I did. I don't know. Everyone can paint, everyone can draw. Just take steps and practice and patience. Let's do the eyes. So, so little Grogu here doesn't look so freaky. Freaky, freaky. <laughs> Where's my paint gone? There it is. So we're gonna do a black circle and a brown circle. So we start with the brown circle. You can use your medium brush or your small brush, up to you. We're gonna go for brown. Can you see? Brown circle and then the black circle in the middle. Easy. Using your small brush or your medium brush, up to you. We're do a brown circle first. Paint over that green line as well. Very steady hand. Oh, have a steady hand. And this one here. Brown what size circle. brush is that, Jojo? This is a medium brush, but I might actually find something quite difficult. Maybe I'll move down to my small one. Go for it. So Max you... is drinking some fridge basan milkshake and eating Oreos. Love it. Oh, you're making me hungry. You're making me hungry, Max. We usually do our um, events in the evening. So today, doing it in the days. It's been different, hasn't it? Different. We were like, oh, we need to get ready really quickly. We'll have lunch afterwards. <laughs> so, yeah, to make us hungry. We haven't eaten lunch yet. We got cream soda from Carrie's A7. Morning tea and juice. And it's 9.51 a.m. here. Kelly Owen, where are you watching from? Where are you? In, in, um, in America. Are you in the NYC? Did the brown circle, gonna do the black circle in the middle. I'm leaning on my painting, which is still a bit wet, so I'm getting it over my hand, which is not good. So be careful of your clothes of your furniture around you. Try not and get paint everywhere. Who's... People are already telling us their suggestions for next week. So oh, we're gonna, we're gonna we pop got? a post in the Instagram after the show and then you guys can pop your answer on there. But Make we've got sure. some really good ones. We've got people throwing them out there. I'll tell you some good ones. Wicked, I wanna know. Someone says, can we do Harry Potter next Harry week? Harry Potter. Would you guys want Harry Potter? Jay said, well, I would like to do Spider-Man. I don't want to do Spider-Man. Spider-Man! Good ones, good ones. 
Remember, we've definitely got four. So if we don't do yours next week, we might do it the week after. Do you know what the Stanton is? Just remind me. Baby wipes. Baby wipes. Yes, that helps. These are your friends, guys. Every time when we have our in-person events, these get used so much because they save the day. So if you have any little accidents, Success. get some baby wipes and they literally save the day. So if you have any baby wipes near, they get all the mess off your fingers, like so, literally, she's got, <laughs> she gets paint everywhere. It gets the paint off and it also, it does one special trick. What? If you've got any little things that you want to get rid of on your painting or your canvas, you can just rub it away before it dries yeah, so if you, if you, you get a bit of a canvas. smudge, Watch this. Oh, no. that's not going to work. <laughs> One time. Testing it, testing it. Look at that, as if by magic. Ta -da. Ta -da. I feel like a magician. Call me Dynamo. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we've done them eyes. We'll do the reflections in the eyes when they're dry. Dry, 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 dry. See, I love that we said this was going to be an hour. Guys, we apologize. Look at the rest. No. We said it was going to be out, but we're going to try our best to condense as much as we can. We've literally tried to squeeze it in for what we usually do as a two-hour show. I didn't want to um, give you the most basic. We didn't. Yoda. I wanted to push. Are you guys still enjoying yourself? Let us know. Push, if push you are, your then zone. we're going to try and make sure that next week we make it even tighter. But if you're still happy, we're going to make sure we, we're going to rush it through so that everyone Parents, can still Parents, let us know if your kids have already Let us know, up. yeah. <laughs> are you still with us? Is anyone there? <laughs> if, 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 your, if your kids are... Uh, if it's a bit too much right now, let us know and we will really simplify it next week. Um, so, we're going to do the ear, the colour in the ear, which is like a pinky colour. Peachy pinky colour, let's do that colour. Jodie Kidd says she's sipping on orange juice and Ribena. Love it. Woo! Jackie Cox says, cups of tea here. Oh, come on, the gym oh, bag. I had, I had a cup of tea. They've gone and done it. They've gone and made me really hungry now. Look what they've done. Oh, they're eating pigs and blankets. I don't think you should eat that any other time of the year apart from Christmas, but why Christmas, not? Christmas is not long ago, was it? Every day is Christmas in my head, right? So let's do this pink color. So you can take some white to the side and you can mix some red, that will give you a pink color, like so. That's a nice pink. So, red and white is pink. You can um, you can make a light pink by just mixing. Oh, my white's a bit dirty. dirty mixing a bit of white and fluorescent pink or magenta pink, and you'll get pink that way too. So either way, so the fluorescent pink uh, actually makes it brighter. But either okay. pink's fine. Somebody said they do want Harry Potter. That was Roma. Says yes, please the Harry Potter. <laughs> oh, also someone says Dobby. You want a bit of Dobby? Oh. Oh, yeah. That could be a show. Like that. From Harry like Potter. that. So we've got a lot of Harry Potter fans here. Who's a Harry Potter fan? If you're a Harry Potter, say Harry in the comments. Harry. Cheeky Harry. Harry, Harry. So if we did Harry Potter, who would you want to paint from Harry Potter? Yeah, I, I guess Dob Dobby from um Oh, we've got a few people saying that it's okay. It's okay that we're running slightly over. Sorry, mums and dads. We did say an hour. I know you guys have really got so many things to do. We're going to try and condense it for next week. Kerry says, I'm loving it. Or well, Jaden said, I'm loving it. Oh, thanks, Jaden. Big up to Jaden. Judith McAnay says, she's having a great time. Thanks, guys. Look, your Yoda's coming along. You look like you little Not Yoda. Baby Yoda. Okay. <laughs> you can even put some of this pink in the cheeks. Oh, people are actually saying that they're actually enjoying it, which is good. Kelly Owen says she's having a great time. And the cat kind of says, we're all good here. We're loving it. That's really good to hear. I won't go any faster if you guys are finding it too hard. So we may go over a little bit, but you should be having, you should have some really nice gravies at home. Yeah, so remember to pass that on, guys. Just follow us and spread the word. Let's spread some positivity and creativity. This is what we're trying to do with Art Sippers. We're doing it with adults, but now we're doing it with Art Sippers kids. And let's just spread the message. We want you to inspire your imagination to go wild. We want you guys to just be yourselves and express it on the campus. Yeah. Well, today we want you to express go -go, but you know what I mean. You know there's I mean. nothing else you can concentrate and um, there's nothing else you concentrate on when you're painting it's just full focus on the painting itself it really does zone you out nice relaxing gets you in the zone 
activity to do on a Sunday. We have the little white bits here in the eyes. We'll fill them in later. So you don't ever want any parts of the canvas not painted, really. So we've got our pink ears, pink cheeks. Let's go with the coat, which is like a beigey colour, beigey, yellowy, tan colour. If you've got oak yellow, it's like um, a slightly muddy yellow colour. That would be nice. You could use that with a bit of white for the coat. So get your medium brush. If you haven't got that, you can use yellow or orange. So I'll show you. So take some white. Always take white to the side first if you're it's making nice a light colour. You can mix a bit of your ochre yellow into the white. I love that colour, ochre yellow. I yeah. actually love that. Ochre yellow is nice. It's like a mustardy colour, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, exactly that. You can mix a bit of white into it and you get a, a nice light yellowy colour. Or you could take some white to the side, mix a bit of yellow in there. Oh, I've got a bit of blue in my yellow, so it's got slightly green. Maybe you want green. <laughs> Maybe. So it's a lot lighter. If you add a touch of brown, a tiny bit it will start going a bit muddier nice like a muddy yellow yeah i put too much yellow in there this is what i like to say mix and blend my friends mix and blend so it's like a yellowy browny yellow so that was white a bit of yellow and a tiny bit of brown or if you want to just go for kind of a brown coat you can take some white to the side tiny tiny bit of brown just a little bit. A tiny bit of brown in there and you'll get a light brown colour too. So any of them. So ochre yellow and white, or white and a bit of brown, or white and a bit of yellow. Any of them colours will be fine for Grovey's coat. We've got a few people on the board, Jojo. I'm yeah, just, let me hey. show them. Let me show them. I'll show you the board. We've got Kay Stewart on the board, Mary Nelson on the board, Gina Brown on the board, Kelly Robbins on the board, Bollywood Dreams Dance, and a new person is now on the board. Oh. You answered this correctly. The question was, what is a Jedi's favourite toy? Nice and easy. It's a yo yo da. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm not yeah. the only one who likes it. Uh, Somebody yeah. else got it. Chloe DMG, Woo! the name's on the board. Well done, Chloe. Well done. You're in for a chance to win sip, a sip. Art Sippers Kids Experience Box. Sip, sip. Yeah, go for it. So have a sip. When you're having a sip, pop your paintbrush down, give it a little bit of a wash. Pick up your drink, have a sip, have a look at your painting. Does it need any improvements at all? Touch ups anywhere? No. Paint time. I'm going to my big brush because it's a large area. It's a big. I'm going to be painting all of this. It's a big brush. Big brush. Oh, bless you. Jody Vine says, boys are loving it. I don't think they could go any quicker. This is our first. Can't wait to share. Oh, we're so glad to hear that they're actually still with us. Hi, boys. Hello, boys. I can't wait to see it. We're literally well excited. Okay, I'm going to make a little bit more of that paint because go for it. I've got a lot, lot of area to cover. So white to the side. I'm going to mix a little bit of my yellow ochre. Mix and blend. So if you've got pens or pencils at home, you might want to go for light orange, mm. a light brown, um, or maybe a yellow. Whatever you think, whatever your pen is closest to that coat colour. Check that out. Just see that colour. It's a mustardy kind of burnt ochre colour. It's a really nice jacket, actually. I might have to get that. Might have to go on, go online, see if I can get a nice Grogu, Grogu jacket. Grogu jacket. Do you think there's a Grogu jacket? Do you think I could rock it? Nice little, jo little Grogu. The Grogu look. Mm. <laughs> I've got his eyes. You've got his eyes. I might as well. Might look good. I might as well go for the whole thing. It's a kind of swag. It's a good swag. Oh, oh Jaden said that he wants us to paint dinosaur. Jaden, good news. Oh, We've done a dinosaur. We did T-Rex. So if you like T-Rex, go on YouTube, type in Art Sippers 
Natural, I said natural, National History Museum. Natural History Museum. What, was, what, what am I saying? What am I saying? Natural History Museum. That's the one. And we did a T Rex. We did. We did Royal Some Rex, and you'll find it. It's a really good painting, I think. I think you'll, you'll love it. It was good fun. I think a lot of people want to do Harry Potter as well. Okay, Harry Potter noted. <laughs> Got Hedwig or Dragon people want to paint. Buckwheat. Dragon. From Harry My Potter. My granddad wants me to do a dragon. He does. He's been wanting us to do that for a long time. He's wanted to. So I think granddad might like that too. Hagrid could be fun. Hagrid. Hagrid. Who would oh, like to do Hagrid. Hagrid? What about Crookshanks? Crookshanks? Anyone's into the Crookshanks? I don't know what Crookshanks are. You're going to have to... And Lauren would like to paint a phoenix from Harry Potter. I absolutely ah, love phoenixes. Nice. It's just a nice metaphor. Rising from the ashes. Who doesn't like that? So if you are colouring in at home right now, this is going to take you a long time. So a lot of colouring to do, but you can take your time. So you don't have to stay at my speed. You've got the outline now. Once you've got the outline, you can get creative and... You can colour it how you see fit, so you don't have to copy me. Your Grogu can have a purple coat if you want. Yeah, that's true. Make it make it your kind of style. You can mix it up. We want you to be as creative as possible. Don't have to stick to us. Whatever your favourite colours are, make it yours. Make it your own. Swag him out. Okay, I'm going to go for it, guys. Maybe I'm going to tell be in you a suit. something that tickles me. Okay, you ready? Are you ready, little sippers? Yeah. What kind of coffee... Do you have in space? What kind of coffee do you have in space? I think it's nice and easy. You're going to get it. Don't overthink it, little sippers. Pop your answer in the comments. It's over there. Keep what coffee it. do you have in space? What coffee do you have in space? You're going to get it. I want you to win. There's a few people on the board. Your name could be here. Throw it in the comments. you got to be in it to win it, little sippers. Let's go. Did we find out who the youngest sipper was? I don't know. I think we saw four years old. Did we got four? Can anyone beat four? <laughs> if you can beat four, then you're on the board. Colour it in. Paint it in. If you're advanced, you can do some shadows and some highlights. And some of the creases. But if you're going to be joining us for the rest of um, the other classes, make sure to grab yourself some paints. If, That's you, so if you've true. got um, pencils and colouring pencils at home, of course you can you can join in like that. But just this area here, like fill in large areas of the canvas or your paper, it's going to take you a long time. So you might not be able to keep up with us. So you can get your kits online. Yeah, I'll pop it in actually the banner now. So if you guys want to get some paints and stuff like that, I think we have paints in the store. Oh yeah. Yeah, we got, we got all the good stuff. So go to our store and you'll find anything you need for our classes. Basically, everything is inside the experience pod. So if yeah, you want to make sure you've got all the kit, we're basically using everything that is inside the box. These brushes are in the Arts of Kids box. The paints as well, the exact paints I'm using today, apart from the fluorescent paint, uh, from the Arts of Kids box. And of course, the beret. Very, very good. Very, 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 good. very good. Very good. Therapeutic, this yeah, this is relaxing. Are you guys enjoying this on a Sunday afternoon? Are you guys enjoying this? I am. We're having fun. We should try it in a minute. We'll go live to some of you. Yeah. We'll, we'll send a link out into this group. And as long as you get permission from your, um, whoever looks after you, so your adult in charge, um, that you can go live with us. We can go live and see some of your artwork. Amazing. So we'll go, we'll go live to you in a, in a minute. Yep, let us know and we'll pop that link into the comments. So I filled it in and you can go in and add some of these creases. Can you see these creases here? Can you see what colour they're in? They're in like a dark brown colour. So you can go in and add some of these creases in a dark brown colour. So just use this, thank you. Just using your medium brush and your brown. Let me get my brown. So these are the Arts of His Kids paints. I'm using burnt umber, so the brown, the dark brown. Oh, someone's told us what Crookshank is. What is Crookshank it? is Hermione's cat. I would never have guessed that. Thanks for giving us a heads Thank up. Thank you for the heads up. I like Hermione. I think someone wants to paint Hermione as well. Zip, zip. Yeah, you're about, you're, you're about high level. Paint Hermione. 
Molly. I know. Perfect, Molly, guys. Molly from the Gym Bandit says she would like to paint Toothless from How to Train Your Dragon. That's a great ah. shout. That's a great shout, Molly. Like that. Okay. Yeah, Sarah Cox. Sarah Cox says, can we do Hermione? Well, maybe we'll put the post up like we do with the Arts of His adults. Maybe we'll put a post up on Arts of His kids on Instagram. Yep. We'll get all the suggestions, and then the top suggestions we'll put as a poll in, in the private group. Yeah. Exactly. We'll do it in both, actually. We'll make it happen. Yeah. So we'll do that. So keep an eye out. So you can do your creases in dark browns, and you can do it while your paint's kind of still wet. And you can do a couple of these lines. Now, you don't have to do them exactly where I'm putting them. So this is giving you the creases. You can do any wavy lines. Obviously, this is not advanced shadowing. Zippers that know how to shadow and highlight. Exactly. You can do it for any advanced tips. level. If you feel like you're a bit more advanced, you can go in and do some heavier shadowing and highlights. So once you've done that, Joe, we're going to go live to a few people. Yeah. See how our little sippers are getting on for the first ever Art Sippers Kids Live. Can't believe we're actually doing this. So good. It's so strange. We actually just thought we'd give this a go. And thank you guys for joining us today. It's really, really magical. It actually feels quite surreal doing this. It's been something we wanted to do for a long time. Excuse us, adults, for the branding still being adults branding. That's not, that's a mocktail right there. It's a mocktail. Mocktail. <laughs> yeah. See what we did there. We'll get it sorted at some point. We just kind of decided this very last minute. Although we've been saying we'll do it for a long time. We actually decided <laughs> to do it like last week. Uh, okay. Let's do them eyes. Hopefully that mine's still a bit wet because I've did put a lot of paint on them. Okay, I'm gonna pop the link into the comments. And if you do want to come live, let us know. Last little bits on Groby's face. Go in with a bit of white paint. You paint these little corners here. So you said, see them little triangles that you might have missed? Paint them white, or you can even paint them a slight bit of gray. You don't want them bright white. And then we'll do the reflection. Elliot, do you mind, um, oh, showing them the reflection in the eyes. Amazing. Oh, I love that. It's a nice little hint. Have a sip, guys. Have a sip. I'm just going to show you these highlights, and then we're going to go a few people in the room. I've just popped the link into the comments, so if you do want to come live, just give that a click. So can you see I've done it? It's like a slight little U shape in the eye, and then I did a little highlight at the top in the corner. Let's do that for this. Grogu. Sleeve up. So my paint's a little bit still wet, but I'm going to do a little reflection in the eye. It's definitely rounded, so it's not a straight line, it's got a little curve. And then we'll do a little reflection, just a little dab of white in the top part of the eye. So if you're colouring in, You've done these brown already. You probably don't have a white pen, maybe a bit of tip X. <laughs> there you go, next coming to life a bit now. Loving that. So I'm gonna tell you guys the last answer because we're gonna get some people in the room. Oh. Okay, so last question was, what kind of coffee do you have in space? It's nice and easy. I know you got it, a lot of you got it right, but who got it right first? Who got it right? Who got it right first? The answer was Starbucks. Yay! <laughs> Starbucks, legendary. Who got it right first? Jackie Cox! Come on, Jackie! Come on, Jackie, well done. Your name's on the board. Okay, we're gonna go live to a few people right now. Let's see if anyone is in is the, the room. There's the Milson boys in the house. We got the Milson boys! Are they there? Are they they don't wanna come live with us. Okay, let's do it. Three, two, one. Oosh! Hello! Hello, hey. Hello guys! Hello. Very, Hello, very good! There we go! Everybody's there! It's a family! It's a family affair! How are you guys doing? Magic, yeah. I don't like being. Yay! Oh, Beach Beach Beach. Beach. Oh, well, guys, Look at the detail. Oh, it's a triple, triple threat. Yeah. You guys have smashed it. Well I done. Love it. So talented. So guys. good to see. Getting so creative on the Sunday. Thank you so much for joining Thanks us. Thanks for joining us, guys. Are you having a good time? Oh. Can you hear us? 
And you guys can be here. They got them back. Oh, you got to move. Go, guys, guys, thank you thank so you much. So Enjoy much. your day. I can't wait to see your work later. Make sure you post all your artwork into the Art Simmers Kids Club. Oh, on I think we've got someone else. Oh, got here we go. Rhea and Rowe. Rhea and Rowe. Can't wait to see you guys. Three, two, one. Boom. Hey. Hello, Rhea. Wow. Hello. You guys are so wow. intense. Oh, my God. <laughs> Well done, guys. Do you paint the draw quite Yeah, do you do you do a lot of creative stuff? Mm, not all the time. Wow. Have that you enjoyed it? Time, have you enjoyed it? Because that looks amazing. Yeah. You have. Are you gonna do it again? Next week. Next week. What yes. do you want us to paint next week? Oh um, my adventure from Harry Potter. Oh, you like Hermione Granger. Okay, so we've got Harry Potter, Potter fans. Potter fans okay, well. we might do that. Okay, so if you go into Ask the Kids and tell us that's a yes, we're going to maybe put that onto the poll and it could be painted next week. Yeah, see if it wins. Guys, it's so good so to have much. you join us. Enjoy the rest of the show. Bye, guys. Bye, Reed. Should we try and, go to, try and go to some more? Let's let's quickly, I'll teach some more of the background. So stay there, guys. And, uh, and I'll just teach you how to start doing the background and we can start going live to a few more people. Um, so we've done the eyes, the background. That was really easy. Get your black and start painting it black. So you can use your big brush. Big brush. Big brush. And as I'm painting it black, we'll go live to a few more people because we've got quite a few people in the stream. So hold on tight. You've Get your big people. brush. Load it up with paint. And we're gonna do, Joe. We're gonna paint all this background. So this is with the big brush. So the biggest brush you have, just literally whack it on. This is what we want. This is gonna be a big surface area. This really gives it some perspective and makes your grogu stand out. So make sure you get some black and completely just take it on. Or if you take want to do, um, to do him in a different place, that's totally fine too. So let's have a look. Let's go live to a few more people. Let's go Hello? live to Ava. Ava, we're coming to you. You ready, Ava? You ready, Ava? Ava, it's your time. Three, two, one. Boom. Hello, Ava. Hey. Hello. 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 How's it going? Hello. So this is with the big brush. Can you hear us, Ava? Yeah, just literally back it on. This is what we want. This is going to be a big surface area. This really gives it some yeah, I think it's a little bit delayed your end, so we're just waiting for it to catch up. So we get some black completely. Oh, I think it's a little delayed. If you want to do, um, do him in a different place, that's totally fine too. Quite delayed. Okay. Have a look. Let's go. Yeah. I think there's like a 30 second delay. Hi. Oh, bless you. We can hear you. We've got a delay. Show everyone your artwork. Let's see Yay. your map. Come on, Ava. Yes. You Come on, guys. Job. Give her a round of applause. Thank you so much, Ava. Thank you so much, Ava. Enjoy the rest of the show. Keep going. Does anyone else want to join us? We've got Amelie and Eva. Let's do it. Boom. Hey, Hello, guys. Oh, oh, how adorable <laughs> was they? The cutest brogues. Smashed it. Oh, have you had a good time? Yeah, it's great. Oh. Love that, guys. Love that. You going to come back next week? Yes. <laughs> I want to get the link. Yeah, what do you want to paint? Next time, next time we want to paint, well, Dobby and oh, oh, Nice. Nice. Oh, I right. love it. Okay. We'll we'll make it that happen. Down. Thanks for that, guys. Emily and Eva, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. So I'm going to paint this quite quickly because I know we're running over as I always do. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna ask one more question and then I'm gonna pull the winner for today. Does that seem fair? Sounds good. Okay, I'm gonna give them, I'm gonna give them one last goodie. I think it's a goodie. I think it's a goodie. So I'm using a very big brush because I've got very big canvas. I'm trying to paint it neatly. Around the edges. You're doing Take really well. your time. You're doing really well. Yeah, I'm doing okay. <laughs> Not the best, but you take your time. Take your time, guys. You Don't go rush. To go to a smaller brush. If you want to carry on after the show, feel free to. I just want to quickly show you how to do the galaxy. So that's why I'm painting it quite quickly. You guys, as I said, can do what you want in your background. But I want to show you how to do this kind of galaxy effect that we've got on here. 
Go on then, what's the question? Okay, question is, to get on the board, cool, it's a good one. <laughs> Why did Anakin Skywalker cross the road? Why did Anakin Skywalker cross the road? It's nice and easy, get your answers in the comments. It's over there, I keep pointing the wrong way. It's over there. Get your answers in the comments and you could go on the board. I'm gonna answer one more question after this. I feel, I feel good today. Get some more in. So make sure you hit like so we know that how many people have been here today. That's true, like our, uh, is it the feed right now? You call it the feed YouTube? Just the video? Just the video, give it a like. And also subscribe to us because we're going to be back next week and you'll see that we can, we'll be posting up some videos in there, some tips and some tricks for the kids as well. I can't believe how good them, um, them brogues were. I know. We, we, we said that. We knew that kids always step up. That's the thing. People underestimate kids. That's the one thing. They've got no Never fear. underestimate kids. Come on, kids. How to the kids. They've got no fear and I believe that having no fear and just going for it. Exactly. It's That's what, what you need. Usually, yeah, makes you propel, especially in the creative industry. Makes you really good when you when you have no worry and you just have some fun. Makes you even better. We're all about having a bit of fun and just playing with creativity. There's no right or wrong answers today. It's all about doing what makes you happy. And it seems like everyone's absolutely smashing it today. Well, they all look like Grogu, so... That's all you can ask for. You did a good job. Um, I'm gonna get these answers in quick, just so that I can get another person on the board. So the question was, oh, oh, let me just let me just double check who got that right first. Go live to a few more of you at the end there. Okay, I think I've got the person who got it right. So the question was, the question was. <laughs> Why did Anakin Skywalker cross the road? Why did Anakin Skywalker cross the road? We can all say it together. Let's say it together. To get to the dark side. Yay! <laughs> Who got that right first? The Cat Clan. Well done, the Cat Clan. Your name's on the board. Well done. I'm going to ask you one more question before the end. One more. Steady hand around these. You can paint the nails yellow. I didn't do that, but you might want to paint them nails yellow. So okay, we've got a few people in the room. We're going to come live to you shortly, guys. So if you click the link, I think we got go. someone in there. Just make sure you've got consent from your adult who's looking after you today, or exactly. who's in the house. Check with mum and papa that all is good. Galaxy. You're gonna do the galaxy and then we're going to speak with Joan? Yep. Oh, actually, quickly before that, so I pasted it all black, and then you can actually dab some some different colours in there. So can you see? I don't know if you can see. There you go. There's a bit of pink in there, or purple, a bit of blue. You can dab in some colour. Usually, I dabbed it in with a bit of sponge, so you can grab a bit of a sponge. Any sponge. That's a great a tip, guys. Sponge. Yeah, don't go and just grab any just sponge. Just a normal one from <laughs> washing up. Don't go grab your washing up. Don't go grab your washing up sponge. Unless your unless your mum's and pups says it's all good. Yeah. So what I do is I'll dip my sponge into a colour, any colour. I'm choosing pink. And just dab it in. Cheeky little dabs. When it dries, it will dry a bit um, darker. That's a nice addition. But you can add different colours and it just gives it... Gives it more of a nice kind of spacey galaxy feels. It's just yeah. loads and loads of constellations, it feels like. You can do that with a different colour as well. So that's why I got the phthalo blue. You do it with the phthalo blue and you just keep dabbing until it kind of blends in a little bit. As I said, it will dry probably darker, so it will smudge in a bit. Look at that. It's really coming to life now, guys. And like you said, this is the first Art Sippers Kids. And if you guys are enjoying it, please let us know. We are still a small business. We have been going 
for a year and a half. We started this up in 2019 in May. We actually had our first year anniversary in lockdown. In May the 22nd was the, the year we came out, 2019. Yeah. So we would love your support. I'm actually gonna pop out um, a link. So if you guys wanna give us a review, hopefully it's good. Oh, it's some a good review. Review. And some feedback. We will love it. I'll pop the Google review, and if you guys are enjoying it, it'll be amazing to get some feedback from you. And next week, we'll try and make it even better, and within an hour. <laughs> we'll and we try. are hosting private birthday parties as well. So if anyone's got a birthday lockdown and wants a private party, that's true. We do do private parties too. I'll pop that in a little banner too. That's my dabby dab dab. And then. This is a fun part, but also a messy part. So if you've got expensive furniture around you, if you've got some nice clothes on, cover up, cover up the furniture, cover up the um, your clothes, and we're gonna get flicking. Medium rush, so the little flat one. Make sure it's really clean. Now I suggest getting some clean water for this, because what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix some clean water not paint water, clean water, <laughs> with some white paint to make it a bit runnier. So there's some white paint. Put it over here. We're going to put some water in there so it's quite runny. So can you see, oh, I dipped it in the dirty water. Oops. All that clean water for nothing. <laughs> um, so you want to get some clean water, otherwise it'll go quite grey. But get some water and make this runny. As soon as you make it a little bit runnier, giving us the consistency to flick to get some stars. That's what we're going to do. We're trying to get this starry effect. Starry night sky. There we go, guys. Can you see it? Yep. That's what we're trying to get. It really makes it look like it's intergalactic. Intergalactic? Intergalactic. Okay, Elliot, would you mind just holding So you're basically going to throw loads of paint in my face. Is that what you're trying to say? Yes. <laughs> so there's two ways of doing this. You could... Grab another brush, just get the big brush. Get a big brush. You can get the big brush once it's clean. Oh, painting my logo. <laughs> you can grab, grab your big brush and get your medium brush. Cool. This does go in your it's face. It's like a drum, you're using like a drum. And you do it like that. Be careful not to get any on yoga, you want it in the background. Oh, there we go. But you can use your brush like this and you can pull back the bristles and do some stars. This is where I get it in Elliot's face. She gets it. On my face. So if you show them this Luckily, bit here quickly. I've got my glasses on. Hold that there. Right there. Yeah. Can you see? So try and I've got it all over Elliot again. Fully got that on my face. That's okay. Yeah. Naughty. Naughty, naughty. And there we go. We're getting some stars. Or if you want to be quite neat about it, you get your small brush. You dip the very, very tip. Just a tip. And you can do those little dots. Love it. And you can do the stars that way. So if you did, if you've got too much expensive furniture or you've got your best clothes on. This is a great way to make sure it doesn't go everywhere. So you can do your dots like that using your small brush. And you get your stars. You can do look with these ones that go down like that. It's fine. They look like shooting stars. You can make them look oh, like great shot. shooting stars. Has anyone ever seen a shooting star? You always seem to see them. It. I see them all the time. You see them literally all the time. You're like, have you seen them? I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> it's always gone. There we go. And That's don't it. forget to sign it, guys. It's not yours until you sign it. And make sure every time you do art, you sign it. If you haven't got a signature, just practice one out now. We usually do it on the bottom right hand side. I'll show you, Joseph. All the picture. So you can, you can. Um... I'm showing your shadow. Oh, my just a little JP there. Little signature there in white. So up to you. You can do your whole name. You can do your initials. So that's JP for Josie Pitcher. So you might want to do your initials. You might want to do your full name. So whatever you like, guys, make sure you sign it and then it makes it yours forever. And then you can gift it to someone and they know it's yours. The only other thing I'd say to do is paint them nails. Oh, I've got something. Yeah, His hair. Oh, I didn't hear yeah, that. His good. hair. I always forget something. So every time I do this. There will always be one thing that I forget. So he's got really, really, really faint grey hairs. Really faint. Can you guys see that? So just add those little faint grey hairs. Yeah, so the just way to do that, best way to do that is use that runny water that you, uh, runny white paint that you just did. Use your small brush, get it on the very, very tip, 
and then you do loads of little curly hairs, wavy hairs, they have a little wave to them and they just go up and to the side. Oh, dipped it in the black paint there. So just loads of little hairs like that using your small brush. Sideways. There you go. Do as many as you like. Let's go live to a few. Okay, so we're going to go live to you guys. And now, who wants to join us? I think we've got Gina Brown. Gina Brown, do you want to come? Let's do it. Let's One, go. two, three. Gina Brown. There she is. Hey. Hello, Gina. Hey, Gina. How, How are you, you doing? Let's have a look. We're excited to see what you got. Oh, oh Gina. I love your background too. Oh, little dots. I'm loving those little polka dots in the yeah. background. Oh, it's the cutest. Very neat. What did you no. use? Are you using paintbrushes? Are you using pencils? What are you using to get that? I use paint pens. Oh, oh paint pens are the so best. Cool. <laughs> Josie's addicted to those paint yeah. pens. They're so good, right? Did you have a good time today? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Have you been have you been to one before of us? Um no, this is my first time. Your first one. Love it. Love it. Well thank you for thank joining you us, Gina. Joining. And come and join us next week and we want to see your creation again. Thank you. Thank you so much. much. Have a lovely, lovely rest of your day. Right. I think we should pull the competition. I think we should. And I then think maybe we if we've got anyone else, we can go live to them then. Okay. Let's pull the competition because it's getting to half past now. Okay, let's do it. Let me just actually get everyone's name into this bin. So tell them who's on the board, Joe. Yeah? So the people we have got on the board, Kay Stewart, Marie Milsom, Gina Brown, Kelly Robbins, Bollywood Dream Star. So these are all your YouTube names. <laughs> uh, so you know who you are at home. Uh, Chloe DMG, Jackie Cox, and the Cat Clan. Okay. Round of applause. And guys, give yourselves a round of applause. So give yourselves a good pat on the back. Well done for today. You smashed it. I'm, I've seen so many now, and they've all been incredible. You're very, very talented. I'm very proud of you. So is Elliot. We're very proud of you, and we hope to see you next week. So same time, same place next week. So just make sure. Room. Yep. Oh, okay, Lily. <laughs> the whole thing now. Uh, these are some of the other ones that we've done before. So no drama llama. We've done that before. Oh, that's our mascot. Oh, no, 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 so Rodrigo is our mascot. We have him everywhere. So Roddy is the first painting we ever did, and that's why he's our mascot for Art Sippers Kids. So he's the flamingo, and he's even wearing his beret. You might see it in the logo. Right, let's do this. Ready? You got them? Yep, I'm ready. Perfect. Good to go. Let's go. You want here? There? Where yes, do you want it? Let's go here. Boom. Okay, guys, this is your chance to win. The Arts of His Kids Experience Box. This, this guys, is coming to one of you. It's all gonna fall out. It's all gonna fall out. It's all gonna fall out. So this is coming to one of you. All your names are in a hat. So we've got Kay Stewart, Green Wilson, Gina Brown, Kelly Robbins, Bollywood Dreams, Dance, Chloe DMG, Jackie Cox, and the Cat Clan. Who's it gonna be? Who is gonna win this Experience box. And the winner is. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Number nine. What's that? What number six. Number six. Six. Chloe DMG. Congratulations. Congratulations to you. Guys, send us your details and we'll get that in the post to you as soon as possible. Guys, thank you so much for joining. Make sure to send all your artwork through Art Sippers Kids Instagram or the Art Sippers Kids Club on Facebook. So exactly. If you want to see them all, flood our, yeah, our feeds with all your work if you can. We might even try, do you know try what? Try get back to you all. If you send them all to us, we're going to do a, a wall of fame for the kids. Yeah. We'll so we'll get all of, of your lovely artwork and we'll pop that into our feed. So send them to us as soon as you can so that we can pop that and we'll celebrate your creativity. Yeah. Thank you so much. And we're just going to see you out now. So see you later, Manash. See you later, Carrie, Marie Nelson, the L M, the A L J M thirty two, <laughs> something from the Simpsons. You want Judith McAnally? Let's see who else is here. Thank you, Stanton. Thank you, Daniel. Carrie Savage. Daniel. Louise. Chloe DMG. Well done for winning. Make sure you send us all your details. Thank you guys. Thank you so oh, much. Oh, kids. We did it. The first one ever. Hope you guys had a good time. We thought you, thought you like it, so we tried it out. And thank you for joining us on this magical Sunday afternoon. Stay safe, guys. Stay creative.
Thank you.